503, you've got the chance tonight to share your thoughts on what happens to the future, well, what happens to the Astrodome in right. the future. We've been talking about it for a while. Uh, dubbed the eighth wonder of the world when it opened in 1965. It hasn't been used since 2009. At least that's when items were removed from, from right. the dome. Uh, but, but when the city closed it over code violations in that year. Our Rochelle Turner, she's live this morning at the Dome, uh, the focus of a public meeting tonight. I imagine this thing will be packed, but what are they going to be talking about, Rochelle? Good morning. Well, this meeting is actually going to be virtual, but the big question is, what do we do with the Astrodome? Some people have said, turn it into a museum. Others have said, just tear it down. But there's one group that says, not so fast. They are going to be having that meeting tonight to get some input from the community and leaders to just figure out exactly what to do with it. As you guys mentioned, we have been reporting on this story since May. So tonight is your perfect opportunity to attend this virtual meeting to give your input. I do want to toss this a video to just try to tell you a little bit about this project. A group called the Astrodome Conservancy started the engagement campaign to create a community support vision for the reuse and redevelopment of the landmark. As part of the campaign, organizers have already put in about $1.5 million and they've, they've already gathered public input with a series of surveys, engagement activities, and formative materials and public meetings, you name it. They've been trying to get more input. And we spoke to the Conservancy Executive Director about what's best for the landmark. Take a listen. The trick is finding the uh, equation that works for commissioner's court and for the public. So the state's historical commission also gets a say since the dome has different antiques inside. And that meeting again, it's gonna be tonight from 6.30 to 7.30. And I'm gonna have another live report coming up at six o'clock and you're gonna hear much more from some of the leaders we spoke to just about what to do with the Astrodome. As you guys are waking up, I'm pretty sure there's a million things that comes to your mind about what to do with this historical landmark. For now, reporting live near the Astrodome. I'm Rich Michelle Turner, KPRC, 2 News. That question, we've we've asked for so many I years, know. right? And then right. who's going to pay for whatever? I know it. You know, Thank you, Rochelle. We appreciate that. Uh,